Thank you, David. Let's talk matters health now. And Kenya has confirmed a second MPOX case in a truck driver traveling from Uganda at the Malaba border. According to a statement from the Ministry of Health, the driver reported that he had traveled to the, to the Democratic Republic of Congo recently, which is the epicenter of the disease. Our health and science reporter, Chebet Birir, with that story. After being declared a continental as well as a global emergency, the Ministry of Health has now confirmed a second case of the dreaded MPOX outbreak in Kenya. According to a statement released to the media today, the case was that of a truck driver who was coming to Kenya from Uganda. The driver has reportedly been isolated and is under active management in one of the health facilities in Busia County. We are doing what we call contact tracing. Sababu mtu wakipatikana, tutataka kujua ni nani mwingine yoyote wamekua na yeye. Ndiyo pia yeye aende akatibiwe. Health CS Deborah Barasa says that to date, a total of 42 samples have been submitted to laboratories for MPOX testing, of which 40 samples have tested negative. This comes about three weeks after the country confirmed its first case of the viral disease at the Taita Taveta border with Tanzania. The first incident was also of a long-distance truck driver who was traveling from Uganda to Rwanda through Kenya at the Taita Taveta border. Mpox, formerly known as monkeypox, is an infectious disease caused by the monkeypox virus. Common symptoms of Mpox are a skin rash or mucosal lesions which can last two to four weeks, accompanied by fever, headache, muscle aches, back pain, low energy and swollen lymph nodes. Mpox can be transmitted through physical contact with someone who is infectious, with contaminated materials or with infected animals. Chebet Birir, KTN News, Nairobi. A section of parents are now asking